this RoboMaster, you want to make sure if it lights up. So if you get uh, one of these um, power banks battery, um, you can you can actually try it all out, see if it's any work, and um, and see if it's any, and you can see it's bright. So you can just go ahead and before you do anything, you want to make sure the light works. You don't want to do all this installation. The next thing you know, something is not working. But this one works. And then I want to go ahead and put this together. All right, guys. So I'm just going to go ahead and show you what's going on here. So I'm going to go ahead and open this up. You're going to mount this. See this hole right here? You already have the holes in there. And then you can use that for remounting. And I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys what's in this um, bag. You guys, um, two big screws. I'm gonna go ahead and point at it. That's the bigger one. So they give you extra on that. And they also give you four of this smaller screws. All right, just letting you guys know that you see the big difference. So there's a little bit big difference when putting this screw. And then this is the the reinforcement. And this is for the reinforcement for the for the roof light. But if you want to go ahead and do that, you want to go ahead and put this on first. Do not mount this together yet. Because if you mount this, you're going to have a hard time putting the screw in there. So it's always better to start make your bracket and then once you start making it and then you go ahead and work from the top. All right guys, now you guys can see, see that the bracket, that's what I did it. Be honest with you, you only need one. You don't need two. So you don't need to make another hole, okay? Just letting you know that. Just, just use one bolt for each side. And then you get these washers, you get these little tiny washers. I'm sorry, I'm gonna go ahead and show it to you. You get one of these tiny washers in it and it locks it in place. And that's all you need. And then you can just go ahead and put it this way, whatever you like it to be. I think it's this way, I'm sorry guys. And oh, so I'm just gonna go also. I might just go ahead and take this one. Um, hold on, I'm gonna go ahead and show it to you. So I'm just gonna go ahead and take one of these bolts. I'm not gonna, gonna need it because I use um, the reason why, also, too. One more thing you see this right here, I add like double sided tape. You guys can see I added a double-sided tape in both sides. The reason why is that because when this thing came out, when I received it, it's open, so it's, it's rattling. So I put that on there now, it's tight in place. And there you go. I mean, it's waterproof, I'm pretty sure, but it's always better when you add something in there so you don't have to worry about water get in there and get fog up for your headlight. As you guys can see, I already got the headlight on, the roof light, I meant to say. And the reason why I did this, um, to be honest with you, there's actually a plug in this side here, but I didn't do it. The reason why I didn't really do it, because I want to I wanna make this, um, you know, it already has a good running time already. And I want to make it more, you know, more efficient, so I just have my own power bank source. And this is also gonna charge my Asmo pocket. I'm sorry, Asmo Action. That's the reason why I have this um, power bank to keep the weights and everything. But yeah, that's it. And now you guys can see what this headlight can do. So bright, and it's gonna. We're gonna go ahead and see if it's gonna help anything for the camera. If it's gonna be better in this environment.
and then you can also adjust the um you can also adjust this one to make it lower whatever you feel like free you know and that's a good thing about it so i'm gonna go ahead and lower it up like that so it's gonna directly have that light so yeah that's it and you guys can see and i'm gonna go ahead and turn it on and go from here go to solo um Just to show you guys, it's still lightweight. I mean, you could even tell the difference for the for the um for the headlight. I mean, for the installing this um, roof. Um, we call this light. So, and. So this is what you see. Let me go ahead and put this up here for a minute. Okay, this is what you're gonna see. All right. Now you guys can see without no without no lights. All right, and I'm gonna go ahead and turn on the light on. It's just giving you guys an idea. see now you see the difference if I you see it's a little bit brighter and I'm gonna go ahead and turn around and then you can see the headlight Now you guys can see, and then I'm gonna go ahead and go down there for a little bit. Yes, yeah, so it's much brighter. And let's go ahead and turn it off. See what's, see what the difference are. You see it's dark. So it it had that. It's a good idea to have it on. And I think it looks cool too, so. And then now the light's back on. As you can see, you should, you should target with it. 